A horrific road accident along Commonwealth Avenue leaves three people dead, a cook, a call center agent, and a vendor, all of them breadwinners of their families. As Nina Corpus tells us, the driver of the SUV involved in the accident, son of senior superintendent Procopio Lipana, remains in critical condition. Jeffrey Flores was supposed to turn 23 next week. He worked as a cook at a restaurant. A responsible son, he would send money to his family back home in Nueva Ecija, where his parents are farmers. Jeffrey's brother Mel shares he was able to go to the site of the accident with his brother's girlfriend. Call center agent Juliet Montefalco was her family's breadwinner. The 20-year-old had so many dreams. She used to be compared to celebrity Aubrey Miles, but now she is barely recognizable. Balut vendor Lisa Romero was a widow. She had been living with her sister-in-law for around 18 years. O kilala yung talagang may sinasabi niyang anak niya o kamag-anak niya na nasa Dabao po. Kung nananawagan po ako na kung gusto nilang makita. Juliet and Jeffrey were just buying balut from Lisa along Commonwealth when they were hit by an SUV. The three died instantly while the SUV driver Mark Lipana is in critical condition. Napagutusan po kami ni Sir Lipana na lahat naman po i-assist namin yung mga victim. Mark's family has promised to help shoulder the funeral expenses of the victims. His father, Colonel Procopio Lipana, has also asked for privacy as the family copes with a difficult situation. Nina Corpus, ABS-CBN News. Mark Lipana has been charged with reckless imprudence resulting in multiple homicide with multiple physical injuries and damage to property.